Hey guys! Welcome back to my channel. I'm Hair Rory Godmother. I'm a hair stylist, salon owner, and hair educator. So, if you are just new to my channel, please press the subscribe button and hit the notification bell para updated ka for more upcoming hair tutorials. So, for today's tutorial, I'm going to share with you how I created this fabulous curls without using any heat. Actually, they call this an overnight heatless curls, but I think Kahit hindi overnight, pwede mo siyang gawin. You can do this in the morning. You can do this kahit nasa office ka. I think kung meron kang extra time sa break mo, you can do this. And ako, no? So, as a hair educator, sa previous work ko, minsan kasi meron kaming mga hair shows and hindi ko na nasa style yung sarili kong buhok dahil wala na kaming extra time for the event. So, I think this idea or this technique will help me for you kung meron kayong mga events kasi napakarili lang talagang gawin ito. Kaya pwedeng pwede nyo itong gawin sa bahay nyo. So, hindi na problema kung wala kang curling iron. This is so easy, so quick, and no damage to your hair. So, if you are interested with this tutorial, please stay tuned and keep on watching! Hello guys! Let's get started! So now, all you need to prepare is a bandana, two bandanas or a scarf, and tie both ends together. You can use a bathrobe belt or any socks, whichever you prefer, as long as the length is longer than your hair length. So now, after tying the scarf, Let's now prepare our tail comb and also bobby pins or hair pins, two bobby pins. And lastly, we need rubber bands or elastic bands. Now, with the use of your tail comb, part your hair where you want to wear it and then separate your hair down on the middle at the back to create two equal sections at the back and move it forward. Now, get your scarf and lay it on the top of your head 1 to 2 inches away from your front hairline. Get your bobby pins, secure your scarf towards your hair and clip it together. Pick the side where you want to start on and secure the other side with the rubber band first. To start with, grab a piece of hair about two to three inches thick and hold it tightly now wrap it over the tie and bring it underneath so it will wrap around the tie until it gets back to the front area then grab another piece of hair and join it into the previous piece and then wrap it back around to your tie make sure to continue the pattern moving towards behind your ear and make sure you're wrapping it nice and tight to help you create a nice defined curl. If you want a much bigger curl, make sure to grab a thick or much bigger piece of hair. And after your final section, just continue wrapping your hair Make sure to twist it nicely so you can create a much defined and nice curls. Once you reach the bottom, make sure to secure it with a rubber band. Before proceeding to the next side, make sure to twist it and roll it like so. And tightly secure it with the rest of the scarf to create a bun. So repeat same step at the other side. Same idea, grab 2-3 to three inches piece of hair and just continue wrapping your hair with your tie away from your face, keeping it nice and tight. Again, quick tip, 
the smaller section you grab, the smaller curls you're going to have. And now on the last section, from this point, I'm just wrapping everything around until I run out of air and keep twisting downward until I reach the end and secure it with a rubber band. So now, grab those tails at the back in a crisscross position, moving towards the front area. And securely lock it with a nut. Ta-da! We're done! Super easy and super quick! All done! Time for bed! Good night! <laughs> so, good morning! So, so now, we will check kung ano yung inasot ng curls niya. Tatanggalin na natin siya ngayon. Sorry for my voice. Of course, it's morning. You know naman ang poses ni Ate Curl. So, yan siya. Tinulog ko siya kagabi. Yan. Tinulog ko siya kagabi. Kaya, gulo-gulo na siya. Gulo-gulo na siya. Okay. Let's take off the clip first. And... Tanggalin na natin siya. Straighten ko lang ng konti yung fringe ko kasi umabot dito sa taas yung curl. So, I think if you're going to do this, kapag nag-twist ka, kung saan mo lang gusto mag-start yung curl, doon mo lang siya i-twist. So, if you want na mag-start yung curl mo dito, so start twisting here on this area. Kasi ako, masyado ko nataasan yung twist ko and then I forgot na meron pala akong fringe. So, what I did, na-straighten ko lang siya. Nag-spray lang ako ng water and blow dry para ma- Balik siya sa straight. And then, ito na siya. And then, you can finger comb your hair after the setting. Grabe no? Tight talaga yung curls niya. How much more kung long hair, mas maganda to for sure. Sipin mo, makakapag-create ka ng ganitong kagandang kolot without any heat na ka. Tignan mo, oh. Sobrang nice ng curls. Diba? Sobrang precise ng curls niya. Nice! So imagine kung long hair ako, di ba? Mas mermaid look pa tayo. Girl, mas mas glamour pa girl. <laughs> Diba? Super dali lang. So, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you find this helpful, please share this to your friends and colleagues. And comment down below kung meron ka pang naisip ng mga hair tutorials na gusto nyong i-share ko pa sa inyo. So, if you are going to recreate this look, please tag me with my social media account. So, this is your hair. Rory Godmother once again na nagsasabing sharing is caring. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for you to be updated for more upcoming videos and hair tutorials. Thank you and bye-bye!